yesterday was April 10th, and we didn't really do much, though I did forget to show something yesterday. So, if you go through here, there's apparently a secret entrance that I saw underground. Um, after we get past the cobwebs, it appears to be a secret door. Keep out. Uh, that sign can't stop me because I can't read. And then I go down here. My staircase. I don't think this takes us anywhere though. Because they're, they're still working on it, maybe, or it's abandoned. Otherwise, the bathroom seems to be inaccessible at the moment. Um, over here, you can see that I've changed the pressure plates. In fact, here's the join plate, and now this area is enclosed in a simple room. This uh, room, and the rest of this is the same. And you can leave properly like this. And it currently doesn't teleport you anywhere. Um, you can see that up here, I've done some stuff. I forgot what happened the day before. But I think it's mostly the same. I think I did add like the opening and closing gates yesterday. Uh, but actually, let's go back here. So it turns out that it's a bit unpleasant to have such a big structure in the sky um, because if you stand here you can see it and that's 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 not tolerable so I just cloned the entire thing and I put it down there but I realized that I forgot why I didn't like it there but I moved over here instead I think it, this was like visible or something this is far away enough though and uh, no it, this one's on the chunk border see I watched the center to align inside like like this would be the center where I'd like the crossroads of the chunk boundaries. It was really annoying because a lot of the command blocks had hard coded coordinates. Because relative coordinates, as you can see me trying to work out here with stained glass, is not very intuitive. And um, it often misplaces. But I think it works now. And not much has changed, I think. Though it's a bit more perfect. Oh, here is another major progress, uh, major pro where major progress is made. So this is going to be the boss battle area. I think it was originally meant to be a lab, but then Brandon changed it. Here is like the wall. Uh, here is the portal. I think the floor will break, you'll fall into it, and that will lead you to the church of Game Pro 5. And then I guess people come in from here. Uh, Back at spawn, oh, you can see here all the circles that Edmund made using the same armor stand technique that uh, Timothy made earlier. If I go to spawn, so you saw the staircase over there. Um, that's because uh, two days ago, Edmund and Brandon were working on these gates. The idea is that every branch, puzzle, trivia, and parkour, gives you a TNT, which you can use to break out this rubble. So it'll slowly dis uh, disintegrate until this path is clear. And then I'm assuming that that will let you walk into the, um, the final boss. But that's not all the progress that we made. Steven was on too. In fact, Edmund was rather disgusted by the command block situation especially this part, but that was, I think, untouched. These command blocks are all Stevens, I believe. And then I think Edmunds is the kind of person to use sky blue concrete. Um, there's some cow. Apparently this is also an uwu. I moved the proof of concept here. Um, oh yeah. Here it appears that Timothy has made the Vindicator chase the Vindicator. <coughs> And when they reach the end, they get teleported back, so that there's a nice animation. You can also see that some parkour foundations have also been set up here. Um, and then here, Brandon was testing out honey parkour because he wanted the gold section for honey. If you like parkour at it, 
I can kind of slide off. I think the goal is to not touch the stone. So if we like so. And then I'm not sure what these command blocks are for. Uh oh I think so the gold section here uh is gonna be timed. I think the idea is that there's gonna be like Roy Monker chasing it. And so Steven was trying to work out how to use a small VI uh to chase you throughout this. Um and it's mostly made of gold. I think the idea is that if you touch the gold or something, then or Loif in general is just mad that you're in a stash of gold. Oh yeah, I think someone built up mountains here. I don't think that was here yesterday. I, I mean, yeah, the day before. Finally, we have the end. You can see that um, Henry removed the black roof for now, and he expanded, made change the shape of the end island to be more, you know, organic. It's like a double bold thing. Uh, and then he has added Temple of Our Lord, the game for five's head on either side. I believe that's it. Maybe there were window. Uh, they're not windows. I think Brandon and um, Nick uh, Edmund kind of didn't want the Lord here because they wanted to de-game profile this. Because 